Grants Pass, Oregon, a small community off Interstate 5 in the southwest corner of the state. On November 5th, 1988, just before 10 p.m., Evelyn Drake is watching television when a pounding at her front door startles her. Outside is her neighbor, 31-year-old David Green. I was bleeding and hurting, and she answered the door, and then I collapsed on the, their living room floor. Blood pours from a gunshot wound to the back of his shoulder as David pleads for help for his family. Evelyn immediately calls 911. When Grants Pass police officers race to the scene, they find David delirious from blood loss. I was fading and I had tunnel vision, so it, things would go dark. Everything was kind of in the background. Before he passes out, David begs police to go to his house to check on his wife, 32-year-old Lynn Green, and his young son, Nathaniel. Officers burst into the Green home next door and discover a terrible scene. There was a uh, body in the front room area, and uh, that turned out to be uh, Mrs. Green. She was deceased. Then the officers spot Nathaniel. The child was sitting in the high chair right in the dining room. He's been shot. Against all odds, Nathaniel is still breathing. The officers try their best to comfort the young child until an ambulance arrives. It's a heartbreaking start to a horrifying investigation. It's bad enough when an adult is uh, shot and killed or, or injured, but when somebody shoots a child, that's, that's really bad.